Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the BTW Hall of Fame induction ceremony for 2013. Making his wearing is the first inductee into the Hall of Fame for 2013. He's a former BTW champion and a former extreme champion. Superfly! Whoa! When you stand in that dimension, I know you feel the power. It's a feeling that you can't oh. get face in front of our everything you ever had. Yeah, it's changing kind of sour. It's all about me, it's all about the power. I said it's all about me, it's all about the power. Oh. Hi everyone, I'm very excited to be the first inductee to this year's Hall of Fame, class of 2013. Now as you all know, Trampoline Mania is coming up. Now I, I don't even think I'm scheduled for a match at Trampoline Mania, am I? Yes you are, um, yes you are. I had a lot of drinks last night, okay, so a lot of coil, a lot of soft drink, I slept all day today, so shut up, um, just don't, okay, um, so, I'm very honoured to be in the Hall of Fame, 2013, um, suck crap, Aussie Tiger, sucked in, King Dragon, sucked in, you know, sucked in, Jimmy Real, sucked in, Brett Hansen, I'm in here before all you spastics. No, um, I honestly, this is, these are the people I re reckon should be in, two other people I reckon should be in the Hall of Fame this year. I reckon Lenny Leninson and, and Brett Hanson, uh, not, yeah, Brett Hanson. Psyche Spastic, David Moore, David Moore, David Moore should be here. I was meant to say David Moore, okay? But, uh, uh, I'm not saying that's what it's going to be, but I've got no idea who else is going to be in here. Where did God? Right, this is true. Right, which is... Right, everyone out there, call out a name. If they get inducted to this year's Hall of Fame, I'll bash them. King Dragon, King Dragon, King oh, Dragon. When shall I attack him? At the next show. At the next show. You know what? For all the people who don't watch this, sucked in. Because I will be attacking King Dragon. If you get chosen in the Hall of Fame, which you won't. Tonight. And when I do, you won't get back up. So I'd just like to thank you all. I'm now in the Hall of Fame. And just because I'm in the Hall of Fame doesn't mean I'm gonna I'm gonna retire. It means I'm gonna punch people even harder. Ladies and gentlemen, let's have a look at Superfly's highlights. Ladies and gentlemen, making his way to the ring, he is the second inductee for this year's Hall of Fame. He is a former BTW champion, a former BTECW champion, a four-time ah. extreme champion, and the current extreme champion, making ah. his way to the ring. Tommy Davids.
Thanks everyone. I honestly I wasn't expecting this. Um right. I think there's more people that deserve to be in here more than me, but I thank David Moore. Oh, oh crap, he's not CEO, he's just, I can't believe Calico inducted me. Like Calico hates me. He, right, second thing Calico's done right. First thing actually third thing. First thing was firing the Easter man. Second was inducting Superfly. Third inducting me. Finally inducts popular people. Okay. So but anyway, I can thank well I'm not thanking Calico. But I'd like to thank you, all you fans out there who've supported me and trust me. I don't want to just be a, re a superstar that wrestles the Extreme Championship and BTCW Championship. Okay? I'm going to go... Right. Here's my goal before the end of the year. I'm going to win the World Heavyweight title and the Intercontinental title this year. And I will be the first ever wrestler to have won every single championship. And trust me, I know Cutting Dragon's only one title off that, which is this title I'm holding right here. And trust me, he won't get it off me. Now, I'm not going for anything like the Aussie Bulldog achieved, winning. Did he win every title or is it just three? I'm pretty sure it was three or four. Three titles. And got him into the Hall of Fame and well, the Aussie Bulldog, uh, I, as much as I hate his, hate his guts, he does deserve to be in the Hall of Fame for what he has achieved. So does Superfly. Superfly was in the first ever match. He won the first ever match. He was the first ever BTW champion. Right? Oh, uh, the people that have been, been inducted this year, the three people, well, I only know two of them, so far, the first two, these two people have been like they pretty much started up the BTW. Like, me and Superfly, we got together and we gathered up some people. But most of these wrestlers here, and we asked them if they want to start a wrestling company, a trampoline wrestling company, and they decided to. Okay, so. This is it. Once again, I just want to thank everyone out here, the cameraman, um, Junkyard Dog, Cash of the Smasher, and that bird is just so fun. But yeah, so thank you all, um, everyone except the people I hate. So I'd like to thank you all now. Show my highlights. Ladies and gentlemen, let's have a look at Tommy David's Highlights. Ladies and gentlemen, the third and final inductee into this year's Hall of Fame, please welcome the legendary King Dragon. Our perfection has just begun. You are gay. You are gay. You are gay. You are gay. Now it's time to shine. You like me.
You are pathetic. I am. You're a loser. Time world heavyweight champion. And you weigh three tons. And I am a three-time BTW champion. And you like men. And I'm a former BTW champion. And I'm the current intercontinental champion. And also the current BTW champion. This is how great I am. And this is why I am the winner of the King of the Ring tournament. That is why I am a king. It's because you cheated. It's because you cheated. I cheated in that Congo stick match. You just did. Because you like men. Let me tell you some stuff about my career. It's now, been crappy. So off, I was in the first ever match for the BTW Championship. I don't really give a crap about all of you, like I don't now. We hate you. But I lost that match because Superfly cheated. And Just like you did in the King of the Ring match. And Superfly won the BTW Championship. But that's actually the only time he's ever won it. He's only won it once. He's never won it at any other time. He had it for a about four months, but he's only had it once. I've had the BTW Championship three times. One of those reigns might have only been about a minute. But that's because Daniel Brogan came in with his cheating money in the bank contract oh, and cashed God. it in as soon as I won it. Hey, what a is, cheat. This is um the Aussie now, ball I've had this title. Listening to this ball crap, in, it's um, hilarious. Stream rules, was it? Yeah, Extreme Rules. Yeah, Extreme Rules. It's been about a month. So I've had it for a month. Now I'm only four That's more nothing compared away to my world title reign. To being... Freaking pathetic. Superfly. Now, Superfly has the Extreme title hey, look for at him. He's a year. Like, I reckon... Uh, which isn't that good. Did he even realise that Tommy Davis issued him a challenge before? And See that Tommy stupid? Davis had the extreme title for over a year, which isn't that good either. Isn't that good? <laughs> oh man, that's hilarious. Sucks crap. sucks crap, eh? You haven't even won it. That's why I haven't won it. I haven't. Hey, Dragon! It. Dragon! You haven't even won the extreme title. You don't even want to go for it because you're scared of Tommy Davis, aren't you? No, I don't go for it because it sucks. But think about it. Think about it. It's hey. way better than the extreme championship. Uh, I don't even know if the commentators right, are allowed yeah, to yell at. Hang on a minute. I, I may be a commentator, and I, but I am. The, I was the first ever inductee into the Hall of Fame. So shut up for a second. Shut up, Aussie boy. Sh hang on. Let me no, talk. No, this is my moment. No. Do you, do you realise that if you won the extreme title, you would be the first BTW superstar ever to have have won every single title. Do you realise that Tommy Davis just issued you, pretty much issued you a challenge? No, I didn't watch all those retarded inductions. I only watched my one, because my one... Mate, you can't, you haven't even watched it yet, because you're in it. Oh, it's just, this guy's so stupid. Well, they actually told me before the show even started that would be the third inductee. You, you think about it, they... The best. No, they did it from best to worst. No, they didn't. They did, actually, they said to me that they didn't do it in any order. But I know that they chose me last because I'm the best. But anyway, back to my career. Yeah, right. Just, I'll just now, let him talk for a bit. I'll then just like, idea. In the second match ever, I beat Tommy Davids in an Extreme Rules match to win the BTECW Championship. But then I lost it about a week later because the, the bloody muscly man <laughs> made his debut. Jeez, that was and funny. And poured all this powder crap over the <laughs> ring. Which did not get uploaded, by the way. And that was pretty funny. Which was absolutely stupid. If it got uploaded, it would have gotten a million views. David Moore automatically gave me the World Heavyweight Championship. And that. Now, hang on a minute. I'm buttoning in for a second. David Moore. The and then I had that title <laughs> that was just for about... It was a few months. No, actually, it was a month. 
then I lost it to the karate man, and then he lost it to the Aussie Bulldog. That's you know, right, he lost it to I, me. And then I won it off the Aussie Bulldog, and that all happened in the same day. I won it. Shut I up! It in the same Shut day. up. Mate, ju yeah, just like you lost it to, um, what's, who, who won the money so, in the bank? Daniel Brogan, I think it was. Um... In a minute, and then I, I had think the world had like child for about two reaper. months. We all hate and him. Then at Trampoline Mania, I lost it to the Aussie Bulldog because Superfly came out with heaps of beer, poured it all over my head. What a cheater! Man, after that match, me and Superfly drank so much beer. You would, it would, it was not funny. And then I won it again. I think it was in a pool match. It was about, I think it was early in 2012, and I beat the Aussie Bulldog. For the World Heavyweight Title. Right. And up then, I. That's late. And then, I think I. 360 on the camera. See, I had the BTW. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Check that still out. Yeah. No, who cares? I just talked about the World Championship. No, for God's sake. He's been rambling for five minutes, man. Shut oh, up. No, I. This is my moment. I will be in here. For as long as I want, because I have two titles. Man, screw it. I'm backing up. And this guy stinks. I'm backing up. Alright. <laughs> now and then, I had a match. And when I smelling. lost the World Heavyweight title, it was the first blood match against the against Millionaire Mason. And it was a winner takes all match. If I won that match, I would have had BTW. Oh, shut up, Dragon! Shut up! You didn't realise you're, you're part of this. It's going on for about eight minutes now. You should really learn to shut up. No, I'll be right. If you'll be right, and Trampoline Mania, you will not be right. I will destroy you. Sorry, me versus you for this BTW championship, frankly, man. What about, I don't really want it just to be a one-on-one -on -one match. I want there to be blood. First blood match. Not a first blood match, a match that has a good chance of there having blood. No. I want it to be a last man standing match. There's only been two last man standing matches in history. And I have won one of them.
and you take and I waited for you but I made a mistake it's clear that your fear is so near because I see the look on your face you try to me 